Hey guys, this is Jamin here at PC Monkey. We're bringing you a do-it-yourself computer repair video today. Uh, right now we have a Samsung uh, Chromebook. Uh, the model number is XE303C12. Uh, oftentimes these are just called 303Cs. Uh, they're very common in schools. Uh, mo maybe you're working at a school and you're looking to fix this. So uh, we're going to show you today a really quick way to swap out your LCD screen. Uh, let me plug this in for you. As you can see, the screen's going to be busted. So the battery's dead. Let me just plug it in for you. So we plug this computer in here. All right, so it turns on and there you go. You have a busted screen. Um, so we need to replace the LCD, uh, put a new one in. I'm gonna unplug that, turn the computer off. You always wanna unplug your computer when you're replacing LCDs. It's not super common, but it definitely happens more often than not when you plug in that LCD uh, cable uh, to your screen. If power is running in your computer, sometimes your screen shorts out. It's really annoying, really frustrating. Um, so make sure your uh, power cable is always unplugged when you're doing LCD repair and your computer's off. So these computers are pretty easy. Uh, the bezel comes right off. So I have a small little metal pry tool here. I'm going to slide it in between the bezel and the rear lid and just uh, go around and uh, pop it off like that. Go nice and slow. This is a little tiny computer. You can definitely muscle this off, but you don't want to. You want to keep as many of those clips um, whole and unbroken as possible so that when you put the bezel back on, um, it'll stay. Oh, as you can see, it's already cracked there a little bit. So, And then go nice and slow. Take that bezel off like that. Uh, so the screen is held in by four screws. One there, one there. One there, one there. Don't confuse those with the hinge screws. So this, we'll take these four screws out. It helps if you have a magnetized screwdriver like this. That way it holds on to it. As far as LCD repair goes, this isn't that bad. You don't have to open up the entire computer. Uh, you don't have to open up the bottom case. So those screws are off, so this can slide out. Now be careful because the LCD cable is still attached. I'm going to zoom in on that for you and show you what's going on with that cable. These are fairly easy to remove. Okay, so sometimes there'll be some tape here holding it down. Peel that off if that's the case. Uh, if not, I have a little plastic pry tool. You're just going to fold up this bar. See that bar comes down, up, down to secure, up to release. Once it's up, just push off on that metal and it comes right off. So it's pretty simple. Uh, so we'll put that off to the side, we'll bring the other one over and we'll just go in reverse here. So we'll take that, there's not a lot of wiggle room there, so we'll take that and just try to put it right where the other one was. I'm gonna block the screen, the camera for a minute here, sorry. Okay. Okay, so we just got that one in. Mm, doesn't look really flush. Let me try that again. These can be a pain in the butt sometimes. Okay, so that looks like she's in there pretty good. Now in order to keep it in there, what I always do is I always put some electrical tape down. Um, Usually they'll already have them there, but for some reason this computer didn't, but I'm going to put some tape on that to keep that secure, keep it tight. All right, now before you go closing it up, let's just make sure that that works. Let's make sure that we got it, that in there at the right angle. Let's make sure that this LCD works. I took this from another laptop, so let's make sure this thing turns on. There you go. So we got a working Chromebook now, working screen. So now you're just going to replace those screws, all, 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 all four screws. Turn the computer off. There we go. 
bed in there nice and secure. Yeah, so again, as far as laptop LCD repair goes, this is not the worst one you could have. Some computers, you got to take off the bottom case, you got to go up into the motherboard area. It's horrible. So then you just take this, I'm going to put a different one on. That one's right there. I'm going to put this on there, just line it up, start snapping it in place. Careful when you're snapping it in not to push too hard and break the LCD that you just put in. So all the way down the side, all the way down this side. Uh, the bottom corners are going to need a good push. And then just run your finger along here. Get that in there flush. And there you go. And that's how you would replace the LCD on a Samsung Chromebook 303C. Again, the full number is XE303C12. Uh, but that's how you replace that, that LCD. Uh, if you enjoyed do-it-yourself laptop repair, please subscribe. If this was helpful, please like and share. Uh, any questions you had, any bumps in the road you hit, leave a comment. I uh, will help you out. We answer comments at least twice a day. Uh, also, check out our frequently asked questions as well as the uh, related video links. Those can save you time uh, if you have a commonly asked question. So, thank you so much for watching.